Hi, I'm St. Paul Mayor Melvin Carter. While the unprecedented circumstances we face in this global pandemic are preventing us all from being together today, I'm thrilled to be able to offer this video message to everyone joining us for the Como Friends Virtual Sunset Affair. We all know that our Como Park Zoo and Conservatory is a treasure in our community for people of all ages and backgrounds to enjoy that on average welcomes nearly two million visitors a year. Como Friends is a vital partner in helping to ensure this incredible asset in our community can continue to thrive. Our Como Friends and the support of our generous community has helped us preserve Como's iconic architecture, promoted state-of-the-art animal habitats, expanded gardens while enhancing visitor amenities, and supported innovative and accessible education programs. This support has also helped us maintain excellence in how we tend to and care for our animals, plants, and gardens while providing amenities so families can come together and enjoy their visit. The generous support of our community also ensures that we can sustain Como's open door policy and barrier free access to this incredible asset. Above all, your continued support and partnership means that our Como Park Zoo and Conservatory will remain the most visited cultural institution in the state of Minnesota, which we've been doing for more than five generations since 1897. Amid the public health and economic crisis and following the tragic killing of George Floyd and the civil unrest that followed, at times it feels like these are uncertain times. But I know in St. Paul, the beauty and resilience of our community has carried us through just as it will continue to do so as we move forward together and ensure that no one is left behind. It's this very spirit that I know the Como Friends embodies and why it's so important that we continue to engage in the vital work of not only supporting our precious assets like our Como Zoo and Conservatory, but that we also recommit ourselves to the work of supporting one another through these crises. Together we can find a path through these times and continue building a brighter future for our children and our grandchildren. Thank you again for the opportunity to join you virtually, and I'll look forward to seeing you soon.